Hello everyone, I'm Lindsay Abbott from Shimmy Groove Fitness here in Chelmsford. Welcome to this Keep Essex Active exercise session. We're going to be using a chair and we're going to be using a circuit style today. So I'm going to put some music on. Please make sure you've got a firm, sturdy chair where you can make sure that it's not going to wobble and you've got space on the floor around you and above you for stretching. Okay, here we go. Two, one, two, three, four. So, just sitting on your chair. Feet are parallel, shoulders back and down. Roll the shoulders. Fantastic. Keep the body nice and tall. Keep those feet nicely parallel. Knees out in front of your hips. And the chin and chest lifted. We just keep this going. It's a mobilising seated circuit for you today. Fantastic job. Gently think about your belly button being lifted towards your spine. And again, just having those feet equally planted on the floor. Feel those shoulders warming up. Keep going. Fabulous. Notice how that upper back area is starting to loosen. Keep the chin and chest up and bring the shoulders up, back and round. Find your own pace. If you can stay in time with the rhythm, so be it. Otherwise, make your own rhythm. Super, those are really building now. Now, one leg at a time, lengthen, flex the foot, good job, make sure your bottom is anchored to your seat, check that your body stays nice and tall and you're gently lifting through your tummy, keep your gaze across your space, nice and solid here, fantastic, so the arms get to be rested, Belly button engaged all the time. Flex the feet, spread those toes, release through your arches of your feet. Keep it going. Good job. So we're gonna work upper body, lower body, all the way through this section today. It's got a lovely little Latin rhythm to work our body today. Fantastic job. Arms wide and in. Are you sitting tall? Are you looking out across your space? Are your shoulders back and down? Good work. So you are leaning against the back of the chair if you need that support. That's absolutely fine. Ideally, you will be able to touch the floor and keep your legs parallel whilst doing this. Body stays tall, shoulders back and down, and again, you're looking out across your space. We are squeezing the shoulders together, wide open chest. Beautiful. Looks great. Super, super job, guys. When we get the countdown, we're going to march the legs, so a seated march. We keep the body nice and tall. We keep the gaze out across our space. Here it is. Arms raised. Legs march. Now, I'd like you to think about lifting your legs as quickly as you can whilst isolating your bottom down onto the chair. Belly button pulled in, beautiful. So the legs are working hard, the knees are staying parallel, you're engaging your tummy as you lift those legs. So again, stabilise against the back of the chair if you need to, but keep that core engaged. So you're thinking about the belly button 
being pulled back towards your spine or towards the back of the chair. Arms are heavy and rested. Super job. Everybody scoot back. Be fully supported with your chair. Bottom against the back of the chair and the base. Arms coming up. One at a time. So again, we can still touch the floor with our toes. We've still got our knees placed in a parallel position. The arm is going up above the chest. And as we take the arm above the heart, the heart rate will elevate. You may find that your pulse rate goes up. If you don't want that to happen, then take your hands here instead. Yep, your choice. So either punching high or punching out at chest height. Keeping the body nice and still, keeping the feet parallel, knees and hips parallel. Here we go. Why not mix and match if that feels good? Yeah? If you're happy keeping those arms going up overhead, then do so. Fantastic job, T. Are you sitting nice and tall? Is your belly button pulled back to your spine? Are you smiling? And are you looking out across your space? Legs have a go. Flex and point. Flex and point. So, nice and strong through your middle. Again, the knees stay parallel. Really flex and point through the feet. So you're lengthening the heels away from the floor. Again, no movement through your middle, but we're anchored. Shoulders back, chest up. We're looking across the space. Hands can be on your thighs, or they can be on the base of the chair. Your choice. Should feel lengthened, should feel loosened. Toes are spreading as we use that flex and point, yeah? Strong here. Great job. One, two, now just roll the arms. One, two, three, four. Right. We're going to stand. Elbows are out to the side. You're making a gentle fist with your hands. Rolling in one direction. Fantastic. All good. So you should feel a gentle breeze coming down the front of your body as we do this action. Super work. Chest up, shoulders back and down. Let's roll the other way. Hips are grounded. Shoulders back and down. See if you can keep your body really still. Woo! Lovely work. Feeling this challenging through the top of your upper arm and thinking about every part of your centre being anchored and you're sitting nice and tall. The bottom is still grounded on the base of your chair. One, now, legs one, out and three, in, four, out, in, out, in. So again, lifted here. A gentle point with the toes. You're mobilizing through that pelvis. Arms are resting now. Great work. Can you point your toes? Knee light on those feet. Anchored through your middle. Squeezing and rotating your bottom. So you get those legs to go apart. Fantastic job. Lovely. Remember to breathe. Check your sitting tall. Lovely, lovely. All good. And we are resting the legs, crisscross the arms, across in front of the body. Again, 
planting the feet in a parallel position. Arms cross and wide. You've got this guys, well done. Keep it going. Be lifted through your centre. Arms cross and wide. Belly button pulled up. Looking out across your space, arms stay nice and straight for this action. Super, super. Looks great. Breathe it through. Belly button gently pulled up. Keep it going. Mobilising through the upper back. We look good. Super jump, keep going, keep going. Nice work. Check, shoulders back. Now, one leg at a time. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. So, you are taking that leg away. Abs are strong here, yes? Body is tall, lifting. Great. Change sides. Flex the foot. Two, one, two, three. Good. Two more. And rest. Then we've got a little surprise coming up. Arms are going to come out two, in front. Punching. Great work. Can you stay nice and still on your chair? Can you stay lifted through your middle, punching those arms in front? Shoulders are back and down still. Abs are bright. Legs shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off. Legs together now. Strong in your middle, both knees coming up. Like a little bow. Abs are strong. Can you keep your knees together? Can you keep your body nice and tall? Are you lifting through your tummy? Engaging those lower tummy muscles deep. Two, one, two, three, four. Arms out to the side. Little shoulders. Arms are flexed out one, to the side. Two, Here we one, go. Two, three, Round it up. Shoulders down. Arms out. Lovely. Are you sitting grounded? Are your feet and knees parallel? Are your hands flexed at the end of your arms? Are you still smiling? Two. Rest. Flex and point with the long leg as well. Sitting back, nice and one, tall. Abs two, engaged, one, legs two, out, three, point four. flex. And down. Fantastic. Nice. Looking good. Legs are together, working the inner thighs. Great work. Super job, keep it going. Are you tall? Is your belly button pulled in? Are you sitting nicely? Are your legs starting to feel longer every time you point and flex? Lengthen. Remember to spread those toes. Nice. Really super job. Keep it going. Fantastic job. Check your shoulders. Shoulders back and down. Belly button pulled in. Those thighs should be really warm now. Nice. Now rest. Arms out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. Out to the side. Then 
into your chest. Fabulous. Lovely work. Isolating different parts of the body, making sure that we are really focused with every single action. Great work, team. One, two, one, two, three, four. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. So I need to scoot forward. I need to be up on my top of my hip bones. I need to be tall in my body. My shoulders are back and down. I need to be gently lifting my heels away from the floor. Hips down, chest up, hip bones grounded, shoulders back, nice tall body, arms just having the rest. So we're working through the calves and the Achilles. We're nice and strong here. Great job. Nice and lifted through your middle. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So really point those feet. Isolating through the calves and the Achilles. Sitting tall. Shoulders are back and down. Abs are braced. We're not rocking forward and back. We're lifting up and down. Super simple. We are keeping everything nice and controlled. Here and here. Now, arms widely wide. Wide. So wide and narrow. Pulling the elbows down beside your body. Again, like with the punches we have going high, if this doesn't work for you, arms can come forward and elbows in. Yeah? No shrugging. So we've got high and down or middle and in. Keep the elbows tucked in, challenging the triceps. Fantastic work, lift. Lovely. Looks great. One, two, one, two. Now, both legs out, cross, out, cross, out, cross. So we're working inner thighs and outer thighs. We're still focusing on our core. As we take the legs out, we are squeezing the bottom, opening through that pelvis. As we're crossing the legs over, we're isolating the inner thighs. Ooh, think that. Stay lifted. Nice and tall. Well done, we should be warm. Shoulders are back and down. We're anchored here. Keep it going for me, guys. You've got this. Excellent job. Oh, yeah. Feel those in and out of thighs, team. Keep it going. You should be feeling that now. Lower abdominals, hips, inner thigh, outer thigh. Stay focused. You've got this. Yes, we can. Beautiful work. Really challenging, focusing on one part of the body at a time. Nearly there. Fantastic. Woo! They really warm up. Here we go. Just swinging the arms. Just swinging. Now, if like me, you start to swing through your hips, bring the feet closer 
to your body and really sink down. Lift the arm up, 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 up. Keep it going. Arms one, continuing two, one, two, on their three, own four. and go out. Like we did before. Fantastic job. So really opening through the chest. Keep it going for me, T. Keep that action going. Guys, shake it off. Slide back. Both legs. Flex one, feet. Two, nice one, and two, tall. Three, four, we are nearly there. Three. You've got this. Like I say, if this rhythm is too quick, find your own pace. Focus on being tall. Lengthen the back of the legs. Spread the toes. One, two, one, two, three, right. four. Ankle circles, one side, then the other. Shoulders back one, and down. Two, Still looking out one, across two, your three, face. Four. four, three, two, one. Four. Great work. Still isolating and focused. Legs should be warm. Everything should one, be feeling mobilised. Well done, well done indeed. So guys, that was a seated circuit. I'm Lindsay Abbott from Shimmy and Groove Fitness here in Chelmsford. Thank you for joining this Keep Essex Active seated activity session. Join me every Tuesday at midday.